Hello and welcome to our last chapter of our Asura Academy. Today uh, we are connecting our eStore with the Easy Digital Downloads and before we dive into it, let's just uh, come back into Design Set Installation. This is Design Set Installation 1 and here we are seeing that we have three design sets that we can sell separately. So let's dive into easy digital downloads installation and start with the setup and we are not going to install it under design set installation we are going to install the plugin under our e-store and to do that we are going to plugins add new and type easy digital downloads press enter Install now. Let's wait for to download it and activate. And beside the base plugin of the Easy Digital Downloads, we need an additional plugin and that's Auto Register. What this plugin does, it's uh, after somebody creates a purchase based on his email the account will be automatically created so he can uh, go to your store and log in with uh, that credentials and in his uh, panel he can uh, grab the license for the product okay i already downloaded this plugin so i'm going to add a plugin upload plugin choose auto register open and install Let's clean panel a little by disabling all those notifications and uh, we need to go under the either Asura settings and under easy digital downloads we are going to check uh, all those three to enable integration uh, to uh, print license and to print license in the received email as well so save changes to create a product in a easy digital downloads go to all downloads or just press the add new we're going to edit the title design set one utility because uh, if you remember we have design set blog utility and shop so we have three design sets under that installation and we will start with the utility we can hide this one and here you can see that this is a Asura Metabox and we will automatically generate the license, allow the license key renewal and we need a remote ID. So to do that we are going under the either and then uh, Asura, I'm going to open it in the new tab and we need the remotes, design set one ID, it's a one remote one and then we need the generator ID as well and it's under the generators the ID is 2 okay perfect and uh, if you remember in the previous uh, tutorials we created two installation one is design set 1 and the another is design set 2 and if you want the generators from the design set 2 you just switch and that's it and refresh but we didn't create any generators for the design set too so you don't have any at the moment okay perfect so we can uh, set the price zero because we don't want to go into payment uh, settings and we can publish it uh, just one more thing to point is uh, that uh, under the generators don't forget we created design set one utility but uh, if you want to sell the blog or the shop you need to create one more and switch here to blog or the shop perfect you can also have the multiple ones as well but we are going to stick with the utility for now perfect update preview changes and I'm going to pause the video now open the incognito mode and we are going to see how it looked like from the 
user experience when he is purchasing the design set. Perfect, we are now as, uh, in an incognito mode. As somebody who's not logged in or don't have account at the moment. Okay, let's add test at test.com. Perfect, free download. Wait. And with the easy digital downloads, the user will right away get the license key. Perfect, uh, let's uh, just check the email. This is how the email from the Easy Digital Downloads is going to look like. So he will right away get the license key. Also, I want to point that the difference between the Easy Digital Downloads and the WooCommerce uh, is that uh, you don't need to verify the purchase. And if we go under the customers, we can see that the uh, user is automatically created. It's pending verification and he got the link to verify it. Okay, perfect. Let's refresh. The user is created. He can uh, now uh, log in. And uh, we see that uh, also the payment history. Perfect. So everything is working fine. So thanks for watching. And I think that uh, with this tutorial, we are finishing the basic setup uh, for the Asura and the Easy and the eShop. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to our channel for more videos uh, like this. And in the description area, I'm going to post uh, the links so you can download additional plugin as well. Bye.